Hello, BBs. So, I haven't filmed for a minute, and there's a lot of reasons why. One of them is I have a five-year-old son, and he makes it damn near impossible to video when he's in the house because he's like on top of me and into whatever I'm into um, but I had a little free time today another heads up uh, it's that time of year where my fibromyalgia and my allergies are at a hundred percent uh, being in a store for five minutes totally takes me out and makes me uh, feel like I'm going to vomit and pass out. It's the pain through my body is so intense. Um, not that I necessarily want pain pills, but um, I got fuzzies all over me, guys. Um, but sometimes I need them, and it's not easy. I have never had a doctor that was like, yeah, we'll help you out, you know, a couple days so that you can eat and you can um, live your life. Um, every day is really hard with a chronic illness. Um, and I have, I have quite a few of them that kind of work against each other, but um, I deal with them the best way that I can. That being said, today I have no makeup on. I do not have a clean, clear face. I do not look all pretty. Um, but that is not what this is about. I am so disgusted, so completely disgusted with Trisha Paytas. I joked a couple months ago, like, ha, ha, ha. Next, Trisha is going to marry a chicken nugget. I still think that's going to happen, but that's besides the point. This woman is dangerous. She's dangerous. Every couple weeks or months, she says she's something different. She self-proclaims all this stuff. She self-diagnoses herself. Do I believe she's mentally ill? F, yes. Do I have issues? Yes. And I try to address them appropriately. But going on the internet, being a troll, and saying that you're affected by all these things that you are not affected with. You do not have DID you psycho like what in <sighs> you are an actor and a troll that wants to be a million different people babe cool cool i'm sorry you can't get hired to do real acting gigs and you got to do it on youtube but you do not take people's mental illnesses as a pawn to make money and get people to pay attention to who you are you are disgusting. That is a disgusting human being. I do think you have issues, and I think your ass needs to go to the doctor and figure out what they are so that you can be happy for real, so that you can stop taking the validity and shit that actually happens to people and what they're dealing with and use it as bait to make money. You are a disgusting human being. And you can call me whatever you want. I'm... Rarely do I say anything on YouTube that is 100% against a person. But I've been doing YouTube for a little bit now. I'm very micro on any format um but this needs to be said like i reported you because you're harmful you are dangerous you're sending people out there with false information 
and you're lying, go to a doctor. Go to a doctor and get help. Because I might not be a fan, but I still want you to be okay. And I think that you can do YouTube without being a monster. disgusted okay so here I am super vulnerable days I've been having anxiety attacks this world is crazy right now and this is not the most important thing however I have a minute to talk about it so I'm going to mental illness is real people deal with it daily for years for the past 25 years, I have dealt with it. I have dealt with being able to get medication, not being able to get medication, um, making $100 too much by myself to get help. And I've done what I had to to try to take care of myself. And I don't use it as a ploy to make people feel sorry for me or to laugh and think it's a joke because it's not. It physically affects my body, and I know it does a lot of other people. It hurts. It sucks. You're describing things you are completely unaware of and clueless. Clueless. Read a damn book, you dumb blonde. YouTube, I'm done today, and I don't know how quick this is going to get flagged, but hopefully someone watches it.